Yeah. Episode 71. 71. Future high demand. Future high demand. Yeah, I don't know. I'll walk on land. The bitch, I'll never walk on land. It's like an opera version of that as well. It's an opera version of, yeah, it's an opera opera rendition of, of uh, High Demand by Future. It's a great tune. So check it out. Um, yeah, if, great if, tune. If, if, that's you, if, you like, if you're a Pluto fan, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, episode 71, we got a lot on the docket today. We got MVLV Rookie. We got a, we got a Krabby Patty review. Yeah, we got a Krabby. So Wendy's just started the Krabby Patty literally today. I mean, I think this will come out Thursday, so it'll be, it'll be out for a couple days. But we're going to try it. I think we just basically say, should you go try it or not? That's what we're going to we're trying to right. try to get across. So, here. I mean, we could just start with that. To yeah, be I think honest, we kick it off want, with that. I don't, I don't want just a bag of Wendy's just sitting there and then and then we tap into it. It doesn't seem like the, the best yeah, it doesn't. It just doesn't seem like an even a, a fair review of the Krabby Patty. You no, know it saying? doesn't. Yeah, and I so, just got these like five minutes ago. Let's and hop then, right into it. I'm gonna be taking one bite. And then I got I got two of them just for the sake of trying them here. They they're rebranding me as Health Zach lately. Um, Who's they? Everybody really. I can't, I can't. All right, so we got the Krabby Patty here. I don't even know. One bite. Everybody knows. I don't even rules. know what they're doing different with it. I don't know like anything just, about it here. It looks like a, a cheeseburger. To me, uh, let's see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, it tastes like a really good cheeseburger. I don't know. I don't get Wendy's, so I don't know like the difference. There's like a good sauce going on in there. I think there's a good sauce in there. Um, I mean, try go get it. It's a good cheeseburger. Nine point one out of ten. Yeah, but yes, I agree. It's a really good burger. Is it di is it anything different? You know, like I don't know. I don't listen. That's not that's not what I'm I'm here to tell them. I'm t I'm here to tell you that's a that's a damn good Krabby Patty. Yeah, I think it's a good burger. I'll give it an eight two. Um, get this out of my hair. I'm sorry. Hey, thanks, Krabby Patty. I mean, listen. I don't I don't know what the the process was in just being able to name your burger the Krabby Patty, but why has that not happened earlier? Yeah, I don't know. I think I bet they paid for it. I bet they paid for the name. It also like, there's no way like they just because that's a, obviously that's obviously a copyright thing. So also, a hundred percent they just paid for the name. Don't you feel like the Krabby Patty is such a McDonald's item? Uh, yeah, I do. It doesn't seem like a Wendy's item for me, but good get. I'm and, gonna and, try and hell of a job getting that burger out. Yeah, um, and I don't know what they do different. I think maybe maybe there's a sauce in there that was different. But go try that out. I would say like like we we reviewed Lunchies the other day. You don't have to go try a lunchly. You've already had the lunchly. Yeah, Wendy's. I do think it's 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 not going to be that much different than a normal Wendy's though. So if you like Wendy's, get it. That's what I would say. There we fucking go. There we go. Uh, should we get into MV or should we call the we, should we just call the breadstick? Um, we'll go MV. Let's go. Let's let's go MV. Let's go okay. MVs and then call the stick. Okay. What do you got? I don't even. I'm a little unprepared on the MV front today. Um, I've got an MVPT. Okay, and it's not an MV most valuable physical therapist that would have gone out to uh, Melissa Randall. Was that when you tore your ACL? And and that would be it would be like one of those weird things if she's listening. She's like, did my name just get brought up? Mm -hmm. um, yeah, well, that would have been the the most valuable physical therapist, not her. It's going to be the most valuable. I'm actually just going to change it to the MVT, the most valuable towel, and it's going to be the most valuable paper towel today. Okay, and it's um, just paper towels. I fucking love those things. Oh, I actually, I'm actually gonna. That gave me my envy. Yeah, paper towels rock. They're they're a fucking great piece. They, oh, they're, they're so awesome. Well, man. Well, they're very gifted. Like they're very they're very talented. And it's such a great dude. Whoever invented that needs way. They better be a billionaire. That and family, why, the the paper towel family, better be billionaires because you don't want to you don't want to dirty up a towel and then you're like, what do I do with this dish rag that's now wet? Well, oh, so you're talking about as a cleaner? What are you talking about? I'm talking about in so many circumstances where it's like maybe I'm maybe I spilled. Yeah, grab the paper towel, wipe it up, throw yeah, it away. Yeah, because they're they're very good. Uh, they absorb very well. They absorb, and then and like they, they they get in, they get out, they get the job done, and then they say, I don't even want the credit. I'm going to go in the trash can. I'm well, gonna and go then to the they dump. die. They die. They sacrifice. And, but they, they're but, so unselfish. But they're very happy to live their purpose. Yeah, yeah. But then they could also play as like if you don't feel like using a dish, they could play as a freaking plate. If you just if you do take a big one, fold it a couple times, bang. Of course, I didn't even think of that. Uh, they could also play as a napkin. They I could was going to say, if you're out of napkins, play a paper towel. If you're in a dire situation, TP. Yeah, they TP. could play as toilet paper. And they don't like to play on on ass. That's like not their 
again, not their purpose, but they're ha- freaking do it. They're harsh on ass. I'll, they're har- I'll tell you they're that harsh right on now. buttocks. Yeah. Okay. You, you do not. You do not want to. You do not want to go paper. I'd almost rather ass. play like a, a clan of tissues over a, 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 a paper towel because they are very. They're very harsh. I went to the Chipotle napkin one time. Oh, f- uh, over a paper towel. Yeah, I mean, it just it was what it was. I mean, it was some, it seemed a no, little everybody's softer. Everybody's done it. Everybody's done it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I was just in a I was in a bad spot where I I I didn't have toilet paper. For sure. So I went to the I went to the the Chipotle paper. Yeah, the paper towel. I mean, that's a great shout. I I'm a huge. I use a lot of freaking paper towels Same. just throughout the freaking day, man. Oh my god, dude. I I'll, sometimes I'll you can I'll just, dry with them. I mean, you'll dry. Yeah, you could fuck if if you needed to. If 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 worse came to worst and you didn't have a towel, you can get out of the shower and use paper towels. <laughs> yeah, you could. If, you, if you needed to, because they would step up and say, I'm going to do that. They'll say, you know what? Listen, the hair is going to be tough. Yeah, the hair But I'll tough. do my best is Dude, what they would say. They have some type of like chemical or some shit that makes them like absorbent. I don't know what it is. They got an Because awesome they're not, that. like they have something in them, right? Because they're, aren't they like, no, I think they're, they're just extra like, absorbent. I though. think they're just like. But they're different than. I really don't know. They're constructed different than like TP because TP couldn't like dry. It gets all crummy and shit. I feel like they got just like a bunch of layers of just. Maybe it's like a lot of layers, paper kind of. Like yeah. they're closer. They like. Well, paper, they are. Pa- it's a paper. That makes sense. It's, a paper towel is closer to a piece of cardboard than it is uh, to a toilet paper. I would say. Yeah. Oh, de- uh, I think so. Yeah. It's a hot take. So maybe it's thicker. It's thicker. It's and definitely just, thicker. It is different material because it's TP is like softer. I don't know. It's a. It's a great. It's a great freaking it's thing. A thickiana. I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna give. Uh, I'm gonna give one out to. Um, and I wasn't even going to do this, but I clean the house every Sunday and I'm going to give it to, I think it's wet wipes that, you know, like the yellow tube. Oh you yeah. Pull out Clorox. a bunch of wet wipes. Clorox wet wipes. Did yep. you know that they're surface cleaners as well? Yeah. What did you think? Ass cleaners? No, I always just clean my, it's like, it's always like, oh, take a wet wipe and you clean your hands. I've always, oh. that's what I've, I've never used it as like a clean the table mm-hmm. ever. Yeah. So I, so I usually I go spray and do the paper towel. But yesterday I was just like, and paper towel obviously came in and dried. That's what I'm saying. I kind of feel like you're you're trying to steal paper towel shine. What the hell is that about? No, well, paper towel played. Paper towel plays in every right. situation. So I I did. I was like surface cleaning with the wipes. I've mm-hmm. never done that. Yeah. And then paper towel came in and dried. But I like that a lot better than um spray. Spray. I yeah, like it better I, than spray. It, I and and I do think that the the Clorox wipe is definitely the most. Uh, it 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 cuts out the middleman. It does, dude. Which is it's definitely convenient, but the middleman in question here is my MV, and that's why I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to defend my MV and say. But your MV played. Clorox. Your MV was a part of this. But you didn't need Danny. You didn't. Yeah, that was a, that was a wasted step. No, but he played his let dryer. Dry. He played his dry. No, he played his dryer, Danny, man. You, you can he just you, his could, dryer, you man. can wipe with that Clorox and just leave it for like 11 seconds. It'll be dry. Just, yeah, I don't know. I don't think so. It will. I don't think so. But um, yeah, those guys are talented. No, they're fantastic. Have you ever? And I know we're we're kind of we're kind of harping on the TP thing a little bit heavy right now. But what's up with like ass wipes? Oh, like dude wipes? Yeah, like what's up with that? It's, it's like it's, cleaner. I I like used them once. They're kind of. I, I don't love it because it's like it's like wet wipes and it's like confusing. I just know people that do it religiously. They're like, I that's I yeah. Need I think that it's softer and like clean and like cleans your ass kind of. Yeah, that's it's what wet I, though, but it's it's moisturized. Yeah, I used it back at seventeen twelve. Graham and Chris were like dude wipe guys, and so there were and dude were, wipes in there. It's just and they can love it. It's just I didn't love it, but like I've never just, tried it. it out. Clean, it's a cleaner thing. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'll maybe I'll test it. You know that was I think that was um, Shark Tank dude wipes. It was. I I just saw that TikTok as well. And yeah, we probably we have like the same FYP. I think we, we see literally the same, do because we're on the same because we're on the same account. Yeah. yeah. Mark Cuban said he, he... That's one of the ones that he made money on. And then there was a fucking some drink or something. Oh, Beatbox, which I, I know that as well. Beatbox, yeah. Yeah, good job, Cube. Dude, that's cool that Shark Tank is like... It's it, it's legit. Like like American Idol. Oh, it's, it's like legit. you win, but you're usually not... It's usually not like legit. Like you're super, like they got legit... Comp- it's not oh, a reality yeah. show. You know what I mean? It's legit, man. It's, it's legit. It's legitimate. It's legit as, it's legit as fuck. Yeah. Um, LV for me... Oh, I mean, it's just least valuable driver. I just scratch my car. I'm just a routine. F- it's a really fucking skinny lane that I have to park in, and it's yeah. just a routine park. I kind of tried to cut my corner, um, and I was parking under pressure. That's mm-hmm. the problem. There was a guy out there, and so usually I like go in, back up, go in, back up, take my time, back up, hang out, maybe eat a snack, then go in. Yeah. But he was there, and he had to back out. So I tried to like go like this and just go all the way in, and I just cut a corner, scratch my car. F- is yeah. it is it noticeable? It's not that bad. You would if I gave you 
a minute to look around my car and find it, you probably wouldn't even find it. But it is like a, it's like that much of a scratch. <laughs> it's water. It's all right. We'll play. Th we'll play through. That's a bad spill. If you zoom in on that spill, there's just no reason for it. You Did just it? got, you just kind of got bored. No, I was just like this, and I just dropped it. I dropped just, my water bottle. Just got bored. That's on me. It. That's um, on me, everybody. Um, yeah, I scratched my car. That sucks, man. That's um, was it like a loud like? Fucking, it was. It a, was kind of not as loud as. The one when I scratched on the garage, when I fucked my car up in the mirror, <laughs> that one was louder. This yeah. one wasn't too bad. It wasn't too bad, but it's just like I deserve an LV. You do. It's like a, it's a pointless scratch. Yeah. On just a routine park, so. Dude, uh, I I pulled into my my parking spot today, and there was just a homeless guy sitting in my parking spot, and he hit me with a like. Like what? Like, like come on in. But I'm like, dude, I'm par I'm gonna kill you if if I come on in. Like he's like, like you, he was like, he's he like, was, ah, you can come in. Like he was trying to play. Like that it was cool. his spot. Like no, like as if like like we're just like yeah yeah oh yeah yeah like all oh, that you can come <laughs> you can park here. But like, and but then I was like but then I was like I didn't know I didn't want to like roll down my window and be like I'm I'm about to like yeah like if I pulled in when he went like this I would have just like smushed him yeah yeah you know what I'm saying yeah. So um, what he did that and just got out of the way, and then it, like after like thirty seconds of just staring at each other, he just like walked to the the spot next to me. It it, so your garage away. is like, or is it a spot or not a garage? It's alley. It's an alley, and then there's just spots like under the little. So the people could just kind of kick in there. If you they can want. if you want. Yeah, yeah, they do. They party. They like use my little they storage container. They just put like a. It's always like a bottle with like shot glasses. Lined <laughs> that's up. insane, dude. And it's just that's you know, crazy that like just to see that. Well, it's just what are you gonna do? I I'm not. I can't. I mean, party guys, party. Yeah, party. party. Well, you know what I'm saying? Don't like, don't like try to break into my car. I, I can don't break in and just kind of move when you get there and shit. But like, they can, they can kick and party, right? Oh, I'm, absolutely. If you yeah. want to use my space to party and store your 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 Jack <laughs> yeah. Daniels, do that's it. That's what that space is for. For you guys, man. Yeah, you yeah. use it. Your my space is your space. Yeah. <laughs> but there crazy. will definitely 100 percent be a day a, where a break in. They just shatter my window and steal my shit for sure. For because sure. it's sitting there. And do you keep shit in there? Really? I keep my headphones. I keep. Uh, a lot of times my wallet <laughs> yeah so it'll be probably a wallet and headphones yeah, yeah. yeah. so it's and then maybe like all of our basketballs will be gone if they want them i yeah. don't know if they'll take those. if they hoop because there's not like resale value there. No. so if they want to hoop yeah which, which they that's might fine yeah. i guess um yeah i'm gonna go lv lvt least valuable tenants and that's gonna go to me and nino okay um, interesting this is just we don't even know this is unsolved we have been living at the new crib since what August, so that's like two months. Uh, but I know what you're gonna say. And we just like got a text from like some a number that we don't know. Yeah. It's like some. I think it's the landlord. I have no idea. I know it's just like say. I'm shutting off the electric. Uh, like if like you have to like put it in your name. I have no idea what he's talking about. Oh, you didn't have electric figured out no, yet. No, but like then what? Then how was the electric on? You know, like I have no. I just so don't. well you have to set up. Paint, so uh, did it, did that shut it off? No, it's it's on, but I but I like you, but right now, like we we just like I don't know how I don't know even what who this number is. I don't know. Yeah, I think that's so what I would have done too. I think when you move into a spot like that, you just have to set up electric. Like it's on, and they have like a sixty day grace period, but, but you but, have to like call like electric in the city and like set it up. But it's like you're, but like who do I call? What does that mean? That's what you just call the city. That's exactly what I would have done. But I think, I think you have to like set it up. I think there will be a day shut in the next it, couple days. Will. You have to set it up. By the time this comes out, there, there will probably <laughs> like, will be a day where it's like, we just have no electric. <laughs> and then you'll like, we'll, and then like, we'll set it up. You'll in like three days. Cause like what we'll videos to film. <laughs> so like for no, but that, but like, we, like will not be able to, we will not be able to film videos because I won't have, I won't have juice or you'll like sleep in mine for a couple of days. Yeah, I just, <laughs> I won't have juice on my phones. Like I got to juice these guys up. Yeah, dude. I, I had no idea how to do it either. Cause also the places we've lived in, it hasn't been like that. It's been, you just go through like the apartment oh, or something. By the way, I am in a war with the Catherine. That was our old place. We used to live there. Yeah. Oh, I think we got some packages there that we got to pick up. We do got to pick those up, but they, I'm just getting billed for our electric, and we do not live there. Yeah, that's fair. That's a if, <laughs> if we don't, that's a fair argument on your end. And no, but then, but then, what do I do? Because because we don't live there, so I'm not going to pay it. But then I keep getting late fees for not paying it. But so I'm like, but I, I think, don't. Live I think there. you probably just pull up on them. But I'm like, because I'm just like, guys, like I can't be getting charged. But are you like emailing them or something? No, I just, I just don't pay it. And then they just every, every like. So definitely just, just I think you just hit them and say, hey. Every no. couple of weeks, it's just like you get, you got another hundred fifty dollar fee for being late. But I'm like, dude, I don't live, I don't even live in this, in this place that I'm getting billed for. I don't know what's going. You on. You should just hit. You should just text them. I guess that's one way to go about it. <laughs> yeah. 
or I can just I'll probably end up just paying it. That's probably that's <laughs> like twenty five hundred bucks. That lengthy. will that will end up happening. <laughs> yeah, um, and like apologize. <laughs> yeah, like I'm sorry I, I paid it late. I'll like end up like I. The only reason I I sometimes get worried is like is would that affect like our credit? Like credit? No, I I don't know. I don't know if I'm just getting billed. That would that was is the only reason I would care. But other yeah. than that, you'll pay it. <laughs> so confusing, dude. Like, yeah. Somebody just do it for me. Yeah. I don't know what's going on. What uh, the electric at your place? Everything. Yeah. Just I'll pay it. Yeah. I'm good for it. Just I don't know what's going on. No, I think it's that it's you're in the exact same situation as me, and you just have to set it up. But they should have told you that is what they should have done. It's just it's just one of those things. It's like, like you got to set up electric. Who? Who taught somebody to do that? I don't know. I didn't know how to do it either. But like, did Sarah do it? We both kind of did it. You just look up like city. David but how did Sarah know how to do that? Davidson like, County Electric. know to do that? I don't. I did, we just look. We just kind of figured it out. But I wouldn't have known. Crazy. So. That's crazy. Um, rookie is um, is going to be a dog. There's there's a dog back home in oh, Denver. Yeah. Shout out to Rosie. Welcome to the Welcome family. Welcome to the family. To the family. That, we're going to need to work on that name. I don't like it. I don't. You don't like Rosie? I think. I mean, I think it's staying. I don't mind it. It's just like a dog name. It's not, I don't not. I don't not like it. But we've talked about dog names. It's like let's have some fun here, guys. Yeah, but you know the parents. They're Rosie. They're just. They're just gonna do. Yeah, but you're telling me because they're. I think their reasoning is you can't change the name because. Uh, no, but we changed Lila's name. Yeah, but Lila was like six months old or whatever. This dog is. She's a vet. Like this How dog old is, is she? This dog's been in the game for two years. Oh, she's a two year old. Like she's not. No, just, Lila. I don't think Lila was six months. I think she was like a year or no. two. She was still like a rookie. Like she was still like, she was raw. Because she had a previous owner. Yeah, but Lila was raw. she had a shitty owner. Lila. So that, that's why we almost changed it cause we, to get her away from yeah, that. Because yeah. she was like scared of the name. Really sad. Um, Lila was still raw. She had no, like nobody had coached her up. Nobody, like she had no. So where did Rosie play? What system she played? I think Rosie this? played um, at a foster. Uh, at triple a, foster a? Was it triple A ball? It was double A ball. Double A ball, but like a but like a five star prospect. Like, got it. And she's yeah. second baseman, right? Second baseman. Um, I think that cool. cool. If you're gonna change, like, you could change it to Murray, and that dog would not know. You could change it to Murray, yeah. Rosie Murray, the same thing. The same Murray thing. would be cute. Murray and and mom loves Murray. Yeah, and everybody loves Murray in Denver. Murray you know? is a good name. Yeah, it is a girl. So yeah. I don't know if that's a girl name. You keep talking. I'm gonna throw this away so it doesn't. Um, hold on. I got a DM that I'm supposed to say a word four times. Yeah, it should be Murray. Um, it, I, I just don't see, I just don't see why we don't change into that. I think the only, the only reason you wouldn't is because it's not a girl name, whatever. Okay. It doesn't matter. The dog Murray, doesn't, Murray could play girl if it has to. That why not? Work. Yeah. It's like a last name. Yeah. Murray's cute. I actually really like Murray. Murray's the name. Let's do it. Like it's not Jokic for that dog, but it's Murray. Yeah. Um. So what? That's your rookie. That's my rookie. I told Krabby Patty before this. I said if you if you perform uh, in the car, I said if you perform, I'll give you the rookie. Um. I'll give him the rookie. The Krabby. Wow. The Wendy's Krabby Patty. I mean, it was a good burger. No, I and and it it is a rookie. I think it's brand new. It's not like a. It's, a, it's like four hours old. It's just I I struggle to differentiate it. Like I thought, maybe it was gonna have some some interesting weird thing. I thought it was gonna like the package was gonna be like flamboyant, or like, the, like or like the, a sauce was gonna punch us. That's what I'm saying. Something. Like I thought it was gonna be just a bigger deal. Yeah, and it, and it it seems like they kind of just took the name Krabby Patty and 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 they're but dude, even like the person in front of me, it was like Krabby Patty. Like everyone's ordering. Yeah, it. I so I mean, why good, wouldn't you? Good marketing. Wouldn't you? That's a good rookie. Shout um, out to the, the the KP. The KP, and then you got a confesso. I'm gonna see if I have a confesso. Um, my confession. I don't have a confession. Oh, my! I do have a confession. This is a confession. What's your confession? Um. Oh man, AJ and, and Justice are at the Knicks game. That's they're funny. playing. They're just. I mean, I don't know. I just saw. They're I just playing ball. My phone. I just saw Big Justice bringing the ball up. So I don't know. I don't know what that is. But. I need. To, I need to get a hold of that content. That's great stuff. Um. I uh, I bought a vape for like eleven minutes the other day. That's fine. Were you, it was, was it, it just was, like when you were out? Yeah, we were out. Yeah, and I was fine. like, but yeah, but it's that's such a crate. Like the the career on that vape was just like 
So you bought it because you wanted it, and then you threw it away. I mean, well, because I was like, before I go to bed, it's like if I if I wake up and I have it, then I'll I might just like have a week. Like I'll I'll just tap it. This, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I was like, before I go to bed, I gotta just throw it away. Yeah, that's smart. But that's just like such a that's a bad move. That's a that's a just a boneheaded play. But like, yeah, it's a boneheaded play. But it's a it's a it's a veteran play to just chuck it away. I guess, yeah. It's just a, it's a, it's a ridiculous. It's just a ridiculous move. Yeah, yeah. It's ridiculous. But you that just, if if you do if you are like not if you don't want to rip it when you're not drinking. Yeah, you might as well throw it away. Which you don't want to rip it if you're not drinking. But if it's sitting on my desk, I might just do it because it's there. Because I'm like, that's gonna like taste really good, right? And it'll now. be kind of fun for thirty seconds. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. And then you just and then all of a sudden you're back into it. Yeah. That's smart. Yeah. That's a good throwaway. Yeah. That is, that's a good confession though. I don't really have a confession. Um, do we want to run a Mad Lib or should we call this stick? Let's call the stick up. All right. Hello. Hello. There we go. go. Now we're Got talking. You. How we doing? How we doing? I'm doing good. How you guys doing? Doing fantastic. Is doing your name well, man. Benedict? Yes. A hundred percent correct. That's a fire name. It's a great name. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Where are you calling him from? Uh, Houston, seven one three. Oh, there we go. You yes, Texas sir. fan? Uh, yeah. Now, yeah. I'm kind of like you. I kind of like hop on the bandwagon. And there's so nothing. They're good now, so I'm a fan now. It's a great reason to be a fan. There's nothing wrong with that at all. You got CJ. 100%. CJ's that guy. All right. What are these? Uh, what what picks you want to get off today? Yeah. So I got four picks today. Um, it. first one, we're gonna start with the. The game across the pond. Ooh. Um, we're going to start with Trevor Lawrence. Trevor okay. Lawrence. Um, and we're going to do um, under 228.5 passing yards. T. Lawrence that. under. My reasoning is because, you know, he's got that great lion's mane. Yes. The, that big head of hair. Mm-hmm. But no facial hair, and that's really <laughs> concerning. Well, you can't trust the guy with no beard and, and that much hair up top. You know, like what do you what are we hiding? You what's know? like what's what's going on? Exactly. You know, yeah. It's my exact thought process. That's I a, think that's a very advanced pick. It's that's very shocking. it's very sound. It it's is. a very sound pick. What do you got next? Uh, next one, keeping it close to home. Uh, CJ Stroud. We have him throwing yep. over fifty nine and a half passing yards. And my reasoning for this one is. Uh, quite frankly, the Patriots are ass. So and that's a great point as well. I, I would really like it if you didn't quote me on that. But, <laughs> you know, you can quote me on that. Okay. But I would love it if you didn't, yeah. but I stand by it. Okay. No, and I think you could definitely stand on that. I mean, the team's bad. I think, didn't they just announce? Who are they starting? Uh, was it Mac Jones? I think it was Mac. Well, who's their, their new? Uh, Drake May, I think, is getting the start, right? I, they're so ass. I they're don't ass. Know. Yeah, I mean, and that's fine. You know what I'm saying? That's uh, you don't have to feel bad about saying that. That's two for two in my books. I think. No, I like both of them oh, as well. Perfect. Mm-hmm. Uh, for the third pick, um, it's Kirk Tober. So we'll have Kirk Cousins throwing <laughs> over two thirty and a half passing yards. Uh, her dude's like a beast in October for uh-huh. no reason whatsoever. Uh, yeah, just like Jalen Green when he has a kid, just kind of goes crazy. <laughs> yeah, happy, happy Kirk Tober. By the way, we should—that's the first thing we should have said. I know. I didn't. I, I actually forgot to say that. Yeah, yeah happy Kirk Tober. Really. How are you celebrating your Kirk? Yeah, Tober? what are you doing? Just throwing something on the grill? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just throwing something on the grill. Uh, nothing crazy. Just yeah. Hanging, we, out uh, with, hanging out with family. A little we bit. went crazy for Kirk Tober this year. We went. Yeah, well, we went. Ham. I mean, we celebrate. Uh, normally, we celebrate privately. We, we said, like, you know what? Let's let's let's. Why not? We're no, we're not getting any younger. So let's, we got a table. Enjoy, yeah, yeah, we went let's crazy. Enjoy yeah. Kirk Tober. Yeah, yeah, it was fun. Yeah, that's. You know, I think I got to start going more crazy <laughs> yeah. in, the, in, in the future. Yeah, yeah. no, definitely. Yeah. Uh, what do you got for your final pick? Uh, final pick. Um, I have Derrick Henry uh, going over. 0.5 rushing touchdowns. Mm-hmm. He's got the body that I wish mine was built like. I mean, 247, <laughs> pure muscle. I, I mean, I just want to be like him, so he's definitely going over. I like, I like all those picks a lot, man. No, I do too. By the way, I don't think anybody's gone 4 for 4, so I think if you go 4 for 4, we'll have you back on next week. I, I mean, the, the picks, they're sound. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I, so I we got... It's a perfect card. So we got T. Lawrence under passing yards, CJ Stroud over passing yards, Kirk Cousins over because it's Kirk Tober. Of course. Derrick Henry over 0.5 rushing TDs. Bang. You got Bang. anything else? You got a, you got maybe a complaint you want to get off your chest? Yeah, I do have one complaint. Go ahead. And I really don't want to be disrespectful, mm-hmm. but 
I know I know y'all's family tree kind of has a history of of guys dabbling as weathermen. Like I know your great great uncle and your great uncle and your yeah. uncle now yeah. are all weathermen, but uh-huh. like shit, man, it's it's your job to get the weather right. Right. So yes. you tell me what to expect and you're always wrong. Like so holy f- yeah. 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 Holy f- is right. <laughs> holy f- yeah, like, I have to plan around your prediction, uh-huh. and yeah. when you're wrong, which you are ninety percent of the time, <laughs> my plans get thrown out the damn window. Uh-huh. Like, no, we're really no sense. We're really sorry about that, man. Yeah. We don't we don't mean to do that. We don't mean harm like that. No, and I I think it's it's a very it's a very valid complaint. It's like, dude, if your if your job is to fucking dude, tell, that is, tell me if I need to wear a hoodie or which not, it is know? jokes aside, exactly weathermen just get it wrong. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they do just get it wrong. What what's with that, man? I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of similar. It's, it's probably similar to betting on on props. You just probably, you just yeah, like know. you they think know you know, and you just it's just like odds. They're yeah. wrong. Yeah, that's a very valid. Yeah. That's that's a valid complaint. I'm gonna be rooting for these picks, and uh, I think we'll talk to you next week. Yeah, thanks for calling in, yeah, man. Yeah, I, yeah, man. I appreciate y'all, man. I hope that. How did the dog do? The uh, dog, hit on both. The dog did did it hit on both? hit on both hit on both. Yeah, two for two. So Man. we'll probably have the dog back on too. But yeah, we got to tail yeah. those picks. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. All right. Oh, appreciate you for coming on. Appreciate you, man. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I forgot to tell you, uh, Toad's been Toad's been flashing <laughs> me down. He's pounding at my window right now. <laughs> oh, dude, I, I fucking hear it in the background. Dude, just get a. I, yeah, I, get. I told him that I was talking <laughs> to you guys. Did he's you, been asking me like crazy. Did you get a restraining order? Just do a restraining. You have to go legal with him, or else it doesn't. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Man, we're right. gonna say, hey, we're gonna send it. Hey, we're hey, just, just stay calm. We're gonna send some help to you, man. Just, just, just keep calm, brother. All right, yeah, I appreciate that. <laughs> All right, stay safe, it. stay right. safe, man. Right, take care, man. All right, y'all too. Peace out. What a guy. <laughs> what a stick, man. What a fucking guy. Um, I mean, he had those, the toad. Was he doing that? That was great. I think Toad was doing it. That was, that was that's what I'm saying. He, yeah, Toad. Yeah. Um, I like those picks too. I'll, I'll read them off one more time here. If you want to be the next breadstick to call in, by the way. Um, download underdog use code breadbasket and deposit and send us a screenshot. Bang. Trevor Lawrence under passing yard, CJ Stroud over, Kirk Cousins over, Derrick Henry over 0.5 rushing TDs. I like those. Easy. Um, should we go into a mad lib here? Let's go into a mad lib. Let's go mad lib. Um, I think it's back to you. I think I did the last one. So I, I, so I'm writing these. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm going to try to just first thing that comes to mind. I'm going to go rapid fire. Okay. Let's see here. I'm going to close my eyes. I don't really actually. I don't even think close my eyes really does much. Do you want to do? Do you want to do newspaper ads, fable number one, or my dream man? My dream. No, oh, no, not that. Let's see if there's a my dream woman. How to go to sleep, fable number two. Army. Just tell me when to stop. Army information, travel suggestion. Hell no. Nah. Description of wedding. Yeah. Yeah. Let's describe a wedding. My dream girl. My let's, dream girl. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Adjective color, pink. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. Wait, so but we need an adjective before that. Oh, adjective color. Yeah. Uh, so like, so like a what? Like a I think adjective stinky, is stinky pink. Stinky, stinky pink. That's not. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you said what you said. Plural noun. Um, can I go back to stinky first thing? Pink for, no, or is no, that, no, okay. no. Um, you have to keep that plural. Noun. First thing, don't even take. Go, go. Plural uh, noun. Uh, ah, knockers. Knockers. Okay, <laughs> okay. We're doing dream girl, right? Yeah. Well, no, but don't I think. Okay, but the I, whole I, point, I'm not even thinking about that. That's you know not what? what I'm thinking. Of. I fucked it up because I shouldn't have read my dream girl because you're supposed to not have any idea what's going <laughs> right, on. Right. Right. So try if you can to like. Just, okay. I'll it, maybe just try like, to forget about that. Or like Oreos yeah, or like right, like right, Slinky. Right. I'll just yes. Adjective. Um. Juicy. Okay. <laughs> Again, just don't the my dream girl thing. Throw that out the window. Okay. Type of liquid. <laughs> Um, we'll do like, uh, we'll do, we'll just, we'll do lemonade. Lemonade. Okay. <laughs> lemonade. Lemonade. Okay. Uh, adjective. Um, moist. <laughs> moist. Uh, plural noun. Uh, breasts. <laughs> okay. Breasts. And you're, you're just doing general now, right? You're oh, well not- now, cause at this point I erased the whole title thing. I don't, I'm not even thinking about that. So you're not thinking my dream no. girl anymore. Adjective. Um, thick. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thick. Noun. Uh. <laughs> boob. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, that's general. That's, that's not just, that's, that's not my dream job. Not, yeah. Person in Rome. Danny. Okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Danny. Um exclamation. <laughs> okay. I don't know any other explanation. What else could you say? Yay! Bingo! Yeah, well, yeah bingo is like all I have. Bingo and yeah, and f bingo and f that's pretty much it. Adjective. Um dope. Okay. Yeah. That got a little more general there. <laughs> yeah. Adjective. Um stupid. Stupid. Like, sh like with it like S H T U P I D. Stupid. Adjective. Um dummy. Okay. Like, so dummy. That's just that's so dummy. Uh adjective. Um uh just bodacious. <laughs> <laughs> bodacious uh noun. Um tit. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, we're going to take a screenshot of this. Bodacious, I just didn't even want to try with the spelling. Okay, so I just folded it. B-O-D-A-C-H-E-S. Because I didn't feel like figuring it I out. Don't, so it's I not don't, a C-H, but it's not far. Don't you know? come. It's probably T-I-O-S, but just fucking leave me alone. Noun, or plural noun. <laughs> plural noun. Um, <laughs> tits? We'll, uh, we'll go eyes. Okay, eyes. Yeah, eyeballs. Uh, adjective. It, we're still going. Yeah, we got What's two an more. adjective, dude? At this point, it's like I don't even. Like scaly. Um, scaly. You want scaly? We'll do scaly. Scaly, and then person in room, female. <laughs> N-A. N-A. <laughs> do you yeah. want to do N-A? I mean, what? I mean, N slash A. I'm okay. not going to volunteer as the female. And you're not going to call me not. a female? Yeah. yeah. All right. Let's get into it here. The girl of my dreams. Here we go. Has and stinky ladies. pink hair. Oh, <laughs> chill. Where, do you, where did you think the ad lib was gonna? The mad lib was gonna go. I don't know. I'm like just we saying. dodge. What did we dodge there? I'm just like, whoa. The girl know, of like, my dreams relax. has stinky pink oh. hair, scented like knockers. <laughs> Doesn't really make sense. <laughs> All right. Her eyes are like two juicy pools of lemonade. Yeah. That's... And her lips remind me of. <laughs> <laughs> Just no catch on this one. Her lips remind me of <laughs> moist breasts. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 Bang. Her skin is as smooth as a thick boob. <laughs> <laughs> and she has a figure like Denny. <laughs> ah. Weird. When she enters a room, people always stare at her and say, fuck. <laughs> what a dope woman. Yes. Her sense of humor is always stupid. And people marvel at her dummy vocabulary. Uh, in my dreams, I see her wearing a bodacious dress <laughs> and a diamond tit in her hair. <laughs> I would gladly give up all my eyes. They they set us up for failure. Yeah, right? it's like the yeah. I would gladly give up all my eyes for one evening with this scaly female. Her name is Na. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I think that's valid. Valum is funny, dude. Ladies, if you're listening, that's that's, um, the, that's my type. That's that's his type. That's my type. That's his type, man. Yeah. Um, a bodacious. Er, he pictures her wearing a bodacious dress and a diamond tit. Yes, I do. <laughs> In her hair. Yes, I and I don't. I don't think I'm asking for too much. All right, so that's the ad lib there. Or the, I'm just gonna keep calling it ad libs. Um, that was a funny one. Do we have any news? Yeah, I've got some news. I uh, got a piece of news that I want to talk about first. Just, I want to talk about KSI. So. Yeah, 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 that's the one news I have. Um, that what song, do you think? Song stinks. Oh, you think it just stinks? The song stinks, dude. From the ring to the pen dude, to the... Come I on, don't, dude. I, I, well, I know. I think it. it's... I wouldn't like... It's not... I wouldn't probably save it and listen to it, but like... It's kind of like... It's like it's an influencer making a song. Well, it's just somebody went viral like right off the bat be and was just like making a meme of it. And then everybody followed. And then followed. now it's just like everybody's going to do it. Nobody, nobody now is going to have their own opinion even no. if they think it's good. This song isn't good. But the song could have very easily just been like... Like his other songs but are not that great, but they're just songs. You just don't even know that it like, came out. You're just like, oh, like KSI probably has eight songs that exist. Definitely. So now do you think, because I'm, I'm on like Twitter and he's like, he'll like quote tweet people hating on it and yeah. just kind of like, now do you think he's like, okay, let's just make this big and just keep it. Like, I think now he's con like, because he did a YouTube video, you know how he does the reactions, he's just reacting to all the hate and kind of yeah. laughing. Do you think now he's like marketing wise, he's like, this is. Because the song, by the way, has like 2.5 million streams already. So yeah. do you think he's going like, this is good for the marketing? I don't think that was the plan going in. I think he thought I'll it was hard. Much. Like he thought it was really good. Yeah. But now I think, yes, you lean into One it. Eight. You lean into it. Do you think he's you like- just, You just get as- You lean as far into it. You just- Every tweet should be like as flamboyant as you can be. And, and kind of laugh at it. Yeah. And just anything, any- Are you- um? 
Can we talk about the flamboyant? The word flamboyant? <laughs> what about it? It's just, I think it's like four usages this month. <laughs> no, it's not. It, two, maybe two. It's not. I've just never heard it, but you you described the burger wrapper as flamboyant <laughs> and then this. Yeah, no, I got a DM and I-, I Oh, are you, I, are you, you? How many times have you done it? Two. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> I Man. tried to do it there at the pod. I just that was so forced. I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> that's fucking awesome. I'm though. so what, pissed. What this was is it from Natalie Rose? We'll put it on the screen. When you left the room, I tried to get it off. We'll, you tried we'll, to just say flamboyant. When you left the room, you tried to say what we'll you were put doing. This we'll put this up. She said, Zach, if you see this, do not read it aloud to Danny. If you can get the word flamboyant into conversation on the pod four times without Danny noticing, you win. Best wow, of luck that's God and I didn't, Natalie. I didn't. That's a great thing though. We should we should have a stick. We should do that every time. Yeah. But then, but then it's like, if you know it's coming, I'm so pissed. I wish I just did it and you didn't know. And then, yeah, great. But, hey, breadsticks, send us a couple other word ideas. Though. That's a great idea. That's funny. So I caught it out to it. You caught it. Damn. And you, 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 you backtracked. I too. backtracked. I'll well, cause this. I was, I was lost in conversation and then I was like, fuck, hold on. Um, well, it's just cause you've never, you've never used that word in competition. No. Uh, you've used it like at the gym, but you've never used it in competition. Exactly. Um, yeah. No, but back to KSI song. Uh, now I think he's leaning into it. I don't think that. But do you think he's like, "Hey guys, that hurts my feelings." You're saying my song sucks. Yeah, I think he his hurts. feelings are definitely hurt. That hurts me. But like, I mean, you see, like even Drake is like. <laughs> no, I didn't see Drake say anything. But Drake was like gambling with Aiden, and um, he just said something like, "Play KSI's new banger," like to hit the max bet. He's clowning him. Yeah, you hate to see that. But I mean. It's Whatever. very viral, yeah, so it's, it's viral. like it's probably good for him. Um, another one, I I, th- I actually saw this last week, and I just forgot to bring it up. Braun, just like so Braun, like like Drake unfollowed him and everything, and he's just at practice. He's just free smoke bumping, playing. He's bumping. just yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. Like he just doesn't he doesn't care. Yeah, or doesn't know. I don't know, but whatever it is, it's just hilarious. To he me. just doesn't. Yeah, I don't. I don't. I just think it's he so just, funny. I think he just doesn't like. I don't even think he knows actually. To be that honest. Drake unfollowed him, or that Probably Drake not, has dude. anything wrong with him, or any of it, dude. But he's because he's also like, he's a he's a dad and he's forty. You think he gives a f- yeah? I, that's what I'm. I'm trying to figure and out. He's if a billionaire. He, I'm trying to figure out if it's that he doesn't know or that he just doesn't give a. F- Either one, but I just think, and he's it, it, Bronny's on his team. Who the f- cares if you're him? You know, it's so funny. But I, just, it is funny. I did see that. It's honestly, it's the most frustrating thing. Like if you're Drake, because you tried to kind of like, you're like, oh, he's gonna, he's gonna be pissed, and then you just see him like doing that. You're like, this guy doesn't even. It's so funny. He doesn't. He's it like didn't above, affect him at all. He's above the law, man. That's Braun, man. That's the king. Because um, he truly probably just doesn't care, and that's the that's the worst. When I know. They don't care. You can't do anything. There's yeah, that not apathy is the worst. It is way worse than. Way worse than like hatred. Yeah, yeah. Ignore what is it? Ignoring, being ignored is worse than being hated or something. I know what you're talking about. There's There's some sort of quote. Um, and then I got playoff baseball. I'm kind of getting into it, and by that I mean I haven't watched a single pitch. But I got the 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 Doyers. Well, I've got the I've got the bug. Like I want to go at least. I want to at least go to a Dodgers game. Yeah, we should definitely go. Um, oh, they're playing right now. If you guess the exact score, are you cheating? Have you seen it? Nope. I'll give you twenty dollars if you guess the exact score. Three one. No. What's the score? Six five Padres. F- Series is tied one one. So let's let's go, boys. So we're in, but they're in San Diego right now. Though. Yeah, playoff baseball. I could get around. It's it. awesome, dude. Because every game matters, and it's like remember Rocktober. That was the most fun thing to watch of all time. Or were you even? I cried when they when they won. Yeah, that was weird. Had you even? But did you even have awareness yet, or were you still kind of blacked out? How awareness. old were you then? I was about seven, and I do remember. <laughs> okay, and I was like eleven. Yeah, 10? I, I was there for that. Yeah, you cried when the. Yeah, I don't. I think I we've talked know. about it on the pod before. Well, yeah. we, so we were from Colorado. The Rockies won. Zach started crying. It makes no sense. I was a Yankees fan, but you weren't. But you did, it I was said. an attention thing. That yeah, it was probably an attention thing. Whatever, and I got <laughs> attention. I fucking got it. So suck yeah. it, guys. <laughs> yeah, that was. They crazy. gave me a lot of attention for crying. That was that was crazy. Um, That's a win. That's a win. That is a win. Uh, I don't. I don't think we ever talked about Pereira because that was right before he fought. Nice he's, win. He's just the best fighter I've ever seen. Dude, four fights this year, f-ing four knockouts. I think he was sick. Four too. defenses. Like he was gonna pull out. Yeah, he's a beast, dude. How about how about uh, Roundtree just sticking in there? What, this a, is, what a warrior. This is how the UFC goes, though. Like now he's a fan favorite. Not that I. I mean, as a casual, I didn't know him coming in. I didn't know him either. Now, I'm sure people knew him. His next fight, I'm going to be like rooting for him hard. Uh, dude, I almost, I 
did you did you watch you watch the fight in real time? Yeah. Um, Stream East was struggling. Yeah, uh, this is actually when it was going to be my confession until I had a real confession. I watched it on t- on somebody else's. Somebody was TikTok living it. Yeah, of you, of their TV. <laughs> and you watch it on that. Yeah, yeah, dude. It was I. I like found my way to a different stream. I might just start buying the PPV. Yeah, but because I was trying problem, to watch some of the other fights the whole night, I was battling. Yeah, my problem with the PPV is like I wasn't. I, I didn't want to watch any of the other fights. I had like two or three I wanted to watch. So, so then it's like kind of worth it. it. Yeah, but um. Oh, but dude, before when they were doing the stare down before they fought, I was like almost like feeling bad. I was like, I don't want Roundtree to get beat up or not. I like I, this guy's so likable, and he was kind of like smiling and shit. I was like, fuck, this is gonna suck. Pereira's the best. He, he's the never scariest gonna lose. fighter too. Who's that was, gonna beat him? I dude, can't imagine him just losing. I, the, oh my god, I want John Jones Pereira. That's who could maybe beat him. And I think John Jones is retiring fight, after his next. Which sucks, dude. I want to see Pereira Jones. No, but Pereira might be too small. Not too small, but like he's not he a could. heavyweight. Yeah, he'd have to go up. He's a, he seems. Or John, big, you know bro. what? John Jones, you come down, brother. Or can we just like meet? Can we just make a, a contract and meet guys? John like, Jones I know comes the down. Divisions, but like. John Jones fought in, I think, in the division. In light heavy? Yeah. Did I he? think. If he fought in light heavy, just come to light heavy, John. Yeah, come on He now. just so is going to retire, though, I feel like. Yeah, I mean, I, that's they're fine. like they're like the same age though. Like I don't. That's true. Like, Prayer's thirty eight, thirty seven, thirty seven. Whatever. That's pretty old. I love that. I love that guy. That's like now my favorite fighter, just because he's the best. And that's that's how I that's how I root for things. Yeah, that's how it works for you. Let's get into some cues. This one comes from Connor. Um, he said, "At what point is unk status achieved?" Unk status. Um, I don't know. I think it's. You I know think what? It's a state of mind. I, I was going to say... Be, you could be an Ankh at, at 19. I was literally going to say that. Like, I think you could be Ankh at 19. I think... I'm trying to think of like a 35-year-old that's not Ankh. You could absolutely be a 35-year-old non-Ankh. Like, I feel like I feel like Justin Bieber's not an Ankh. Bieber's... And he's like 30. He's not an Ankh. You know what I'm saying? I agree. Yeah. I think it is totally a state of mind. Well, it's just like how you... Pereira's 37. He ain't no Ankh. Mm, he's almost Yeah, he's unk. not Ankh. He's not really an Ankh. He, he's not Ankh. But there's also like... Like, I would like... Who's a who's a twenty? Like Ant is like twenty two, and he's he's like an. You unk. think Ant's kind of unk? kind of, KD's unk. Yeah, but he's like kind of old. He's like actually kind of. He might be an unk. Exactly, but you could be like Yoke, Yoke is, is just unk. such an unk. Yoke is unk. Was yeah. he twenty nine? Yeah, I think it's. But I, he's been an unk since he was nineteen. Who Yoke? Yoke. Yoke has definitely been an unk since he was nineteen. It's just it's just a state of mind. It's a state of mind. Yeah, yeah. You could if you put your mind to it, you could achieve status. You can absolutely, yeah, absolutely. We got Jack. He said, hello, bread brethren. It's time to blind rank these five spectacular things. All right, let's do it. I fucking can't wait. All right, you got it. Sounds spectacular. In the one, we have chocolate. Where do you want to put chocolate today? I'm going to I'm gonna be like responsible and Great put it in sweets. the three, but it could absolutely be number one. Depends on how spectacular these other things are. It depends. Them. Yeah, are we staying food? Are we going basketball? Because that could be one, right? And you and yeah, you you kind of thought it the right way there. Because we're not staying food. Up next, we're going to hoodies. I fucking love hoodies. I'm always wearing a hoodie. Two, two. Okay, leave the one. You're yeah. leaving the one. I mean, how great? How great are we going to get? I feel like there's definitely some things above hoodies, but I do love a good hoodie, especially now. I agree. I love this weather. Not the rainy shit, but the temperature wise, I love this weather. Yeah. Dogs. One. One, yeah, you couldn't put them below. No, and you know you might. You're probably gonna yeah. snub some something. Oh, I mean, what are we gonna come with? Are we gonna come with sex? Are we, yeah. are we you know what? Like, what is boobs, it gonna be? Boobs, oh, boob, boobs, boobs could be up there. I, I don't know. I don't know how much better it could get than than dogs, man. I agree. Um, up next, we have NFL. I mean, I have to go four, but the NFL is pretty freaking spectacular. But I don't. Do you hate your ranking one through four? I don't. Hate I, would, it, I think really. I would have bumped chocolate. To be honest, I think oh. chocolate can. Probably Over down. hoodie? Oh, down. And then go NFL up? I think chocolate could be in the five at this point. Because yeah. choc- I could live without chocolate, man. There's other sweets out there. No, but you're going to be happy with your five. We have Toad. That's so a perfect five. I don't, I don't hate it. Yeah, no, it's not, it's not terrible. NFL should be a little bit higher, but Maybe that's a, that's swap a good- swap chocolate and NFL. Yeah. That's a good list. Yeah. This one comes from Mike Mike Hess. Mike Hess. Mikey Hess. What's up, Mikey Hess? Thoughts on that Mr. Woodchuck? Thoughts on that guy, Mr. Woodchuck, chucking all that wood? What about it? I mean, that's what he does. I don't. Well, I, I mean, I just think it's at so some point. What? I, I, what are you going to say? What are you scared? Danny, are you scared to get canceled for talking about Mr. Woodchuck? I mean, Danny, at the end of the day, the guy's chucking. You can chuck as much f***ing wood. Who am I to tell him how much f***ing wood to chuck? You're an adult. 
Okay, he's he he doesn't know how much wood he can he can and but can why is that trucking? But why is that our business? It's not. Like, Danny, I truck wood. And I are just, you t- I'm worried, Danny. I'm worried about the betterment of of this young woodchuck man. It, at what point is it? What are you calling this wood trucking an addiction? Yeah, are you calling it yeah, an addiction. I'm calling it addiction. It's a dude. hobby, and what oh he my does, God, it, you are enabling. Do you have what, some the sort wood of, he like, trucks in his house is his fucking f- business? Do yeah, you truck, truck with him? Not with him. No. Hold on, hold on. But I hold chuck on. sometimes. This is, no, this is. Are, do I you don't chuck, chuck with Mr. Woodchuck. I don't chuck with Mr. Woodchuck. I don't. And what if I, I don't did? Don't even want to be associated. What, I don't, what, even what know, if I, I don't even know who you are? What if anymore? I chuck with Woodchuck? Danny, I don't even know who I'm sitting next okay, to. What, what did What did Mr. Woodchuck do with my brother? Sh- what? I can't chuck any. All right, I chuck with him a couple okay, times. What's the okay. fucking problem with that? Yikes, man. What? Yikes. You can't chuck wood with a Woodchuck. That's not okay now. I don't think so. I'm oh, not, 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 not this one, Chuck. Not this, but keep, keep okay. enabling yourself, man. Keep enabling, keep enabling my... Oh, what? Oh, no, what? You can't chuck some wood. Whatever. Loosen up, man. We got Lewis. He said, how many cheese puffs would Danny have to eat in one podcast for you to get scared? Also, how's the toad situation? We'll talk about that later. How many... So, say we had a thing of cheese puffs right here, and we were just filming, and we were snacking during the pod. It would have to be like three tubs of cheese puffs. So, you, one tub's not going to scare you? Scare me now. That's because that's the key word is scare. Yeah, like, scared. Am I going to be annoyed? Very. <laughs> yeah. Like, stop I'll be, it. We're filming. I'll be annoyed. We, Probably we, just that I'm even eating cheese puffs while we're filming. That the cheese puff that the cheese puffs are even there. I'm already pissed because just that I'm they're like, there. Why are we putting a tub of cheese puffs <laughs> not, on the thing? Not the time or place. Not the time or place. Okay. So that once we get past the annoyance, and I'm gonna have chewing in my earphones the whole time. I'm scared. And we don't at, like, we don't do well with chewing. No. We don't do but well with at that. At two and a half, I'm scared that like this guy got corrupted by like big cheese puff and like he's okay. he has there's something in him that's like making him eat these cheese puffs. At, yeah. That's at two and a half. Because that's something that happens. Yeah. Especially with cheese puffs. And um, then three, what? You're like, I gotta get out of here. Well, I'm like, uh, yeah, I gotta save you from whatever's going on because something this isn't Danny. So it's three big tubs. Huge tubs. Yeah. <laughs> it's tubs. a lot of cheese puffs. Yeah. Blue Jay is writing in again. That bird. That hits us on spotty. Yeah. Blue Jay. Uh, he said, hey, Zach and Danny, which of these do you use? Bathroom, washroom, restroom, men's room, or grown-up big boy room? Yeah. I like pineapple and potassium. Fire. Mm-hmm. This, I mean, that's a perfect question. Yeah. So bathroom, I use, I, usually bathroom. I do. I actually, I kind of. And then um, if, I might be like, I'm going to go to the rest. I think I usually do bathroom. I'll do none of the above. I, a, a lot of times I go bathroom. I do an F. An F I'll bathroom. do an F on there. Yeah. Um, Sometimes I'll even get cool and go B room. Mm-hmm. Um, so you'll just be like, I'm going to hit the B room? I'm going to hit the B room. And then it, it, that one doesn't really land. People don't really like that. Bathroom sometimes is like- they, Or if like, I feel like if I'm just like with you and we're at something, I'd be like, I'm not, I got to piss. I got to piss. <laughs> I yeah, piss. that's definitely like- That's with the boys. Yeah, I got to piss. That's what it is. I got to piss. Also, like how many times are you really- Like, I don't even really announce that I'm going to the bathroom. Yeah, you don't. I don't either. Well, it's just like, what do you- Like, I'm just- I'm not gonna like tell you. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I I would say that with Sarah. Yeah, oh. I would tell her. Yeah, I guess. But like that's because like she needs to know. Well, if you're if you're on a one on one, yeah, I'd be like I'm gonna go to the bathroom. But yeah, if you're on a one on one, if you're yeah. standing at a bar with your friends, it's like you might just you might just go. But if we were all if, if we were at dinner, say yeah, it was you like you, me, tell. Will, and Nino, you'd be like I'm gonna go piss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna piss. Yeah, yeah. With Robin Hood Gold, you don't need a silver spoon to eat up the financial favors of the 1%. Robin Hood Gold allows others to get the rates and perks usually reserved for the high society. Now the resourceful individual with Robin Hood Gold can earn the very liberal rate of 4.5% APY on uninvested cash, receive unlimited 1% deposit bonuses, and be rewarded with a handsome 3% retirement boost on an IRA account. Robin Hood Gold provides the privileges of a high net worth for any net worth. These generous benefits are now available for only five dollars a month the new gold standard is here with robin hood gold sign up at robinhood.com backslash gold terms apply for product specific disclosures visit robinhood.com backslash gold investing involves risk rate may change gold membership is offered by robin hood gold llc let's get back to the show juliana wants to know our favorite sport that doesn't end in ball her tennis thinks they're getting picked um that's a really that's a really astute question there yeah, and can we just? I mean, it's soccer, but that could be football. Yeah, I so think it's, that, uh, it was soccer off the. Off I think the, soccer's off the off the board because that, yeah, that's clearly not what we were a, talking yeah, about. Yeah, that, that's a, that's of course it would be soccer. Yeah, so you see know? a soccer, see a basketball, see a baseball, see a football. Um, I think it's. I think it is boxing. Yeah, it's probably Unfortunately, boxing it just or like isn't. MMA, and I and I'm, then second is probably golf. Well, and I'm I'm sorry, tennis. It's just not your. It's just not your. It's not your. Well, it's not your night. 
No, it isn't. But like that's it, it's it's not always everybody's night. Like it's, it's not. just not your night tonight. And I think that tennis was really looking forward to getting back at pickleball. Like, hey, pickleball, you're out today. You know, yeah. I, I think pickleball is really. Well, he's here. Tennis is here, and he's sitting at the table yeah. with his family because he was going to finally raise a trophy in pickleball's f-ing face and say, "This is this is for you." Yeah, but you we se- we select MMA. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, <laughs> we, we select mixed martial it's arts. It's going to be bowling today. Yeah, it's going to be bowling. <laughs> yeah, but it's probably that, and then I think golf before tennis. I do too. Yeah. This so one comes from Ben Flacker. He so said, what's ben. cooking bad looking? Okay. Over under 2782 snoozers all time. 27, 2782 2, snoozers all time. It's a really good line. Over. Yeah, I don't. Let's do some over? math. Let's do some math. So how many So how many years of snoozers would that be? You're obviously, there's days where you're hitting it two or three times. So 2700 divided by 365. That's only seven and a half years of snoozers. I'm under. Oh, no way. Yeah, I don't think I hit snoozes as much. I think if I'm like, if I'm going to get up, I get up. If not, I just, I give myself, I set a later alarm. I don't think I'm snoozing that much. I think I snooze. I don't, listen, it's not as much a snooze. It's more just, if you go, if you have an iPhone and you just turn it off. And you, that's that snooze. counts as a snooze. Oh, that's a yeah. snooze, brother. Yeah, there, because I, I do, there are a lot of times I, I don't know. I think I'm still under. I just think I'm under. That's, I mean, listen. You're going to go I, over? Yeah. It's a very I, good line. That's the right line. You know how many times, like two minutes into my day, I get an alarm? Probably every morning. True. I got a par- I, a pocket alarm goes off every single morning when I'm eating breakfast. And then he snooze it. Well, and then I just, then I turn it off. Yeah. But it gets snoozed once. Oh, because it got snoozed. It, even yeah, if yeah, I yeah. get up, I'm still snoozing. That's true. Yeah. So you're going to take the over. I'll yeah. take the under. We got Henry here from Instagram. He said, hello, gallant mammals. Question for you. Do you think there are more grains of sand on earth currently? Okay. Or, this is a very abstract question, or times the letter E is used in history, like in text, books, spoken, just saying there are 130 million books needed. Oh, it's definitely E. There are 130 million books. Needed this question to be answered. I mean, but think of how many f-ing grains of salt there are. I know, but are like we, in one but little. Am I when I say the word in here, there could be like a hundred grains of salt. When I say the word need, that counts as two e's. Correct. There's, there's so unlimited... much sand. It's got to be e. It's got to be. There's e. an unlimited supply of e's. Think about how many e's are in this room. There's records. There's books. There's and well, but then also people are producing e's right now around the fucking world. Oh my. There's. And there's, there's a finite amount of sand. There's a finite amount of sand. There's an unlimited supply of E's. And for that reason, I'm definitely... There's a couple E's right here. There's, there's a actually, couple E's. It's E and four in yeah, this one. There's so many E's on my phone right now. So many E's in there, man. I, I do think they'll put, put grain of sand up against any other quantity. They're going to win most of the time. I also think... Like grain of sand versus wheels. But E is also like E is being E is being produced in Spain right now as well. Like it, it's on a different. It's in, they're doing a different program where they're like. But he's playing. Yeah, he's. You playing. know what I'm saying? That doesn't mean. He's, I mean, he's playing everywhere. I, he's I, playing I, in text messages a million times right now. I don't think E plays in like China. They do like a little figure system. Yeah, so not global. Yeah, but, and sand plays there, but I still think it's E. Yeah, I still think it's E. Who do you have sand? But sand grains of sand versus like tires. Grains of sand. Oh, sand for sure. There's so more, that's what I'm saying. There's I more grains of, there's more stars. Oh, there's grains more of stars sand. than grains of sand, which that's ridiculous. That's crazy. Yeah. There's a lot of stars, man. I might've made that up. Don't look that up. Do not Google that. <laughs> I won't. I won't. We got Ryan. He said, what is good? Lovely gentleman. What's up? What's up? How long would it take you to realize that there are no more existing lighthouses my whole life? I think. There, for all we know, there are none. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. maybe there are none. Maybe this is like a troll. Have you ever seen a lighthouse? Yes. When? Why? Where? I was just like on tour, and it's. I actually took a picture of it. I actually used it for an album art. But there, I. Other than that, I'm never seeing lighthouses, unless the only way we would know is if it surfaced on social media that oh. there are no more light up. But we wouldn't even get targeted. That's not our type of content. No, that's not our niche, man. We don't, we don't do, because lighthouse niche, like some of our friends are lighthouse guys. Yeah, of course. Well, and everybody knows a, a lighthouse guy. The thing There's is, a fan is like, base, yeah. I might even see that and just swipe. Like, I don't even know. I, you know, yeah, like, yeah, I yeah, might, yeah. Be, might be like, lighthouses are extinct. And I'm like, I think that that's like a joke. Oh, that's cool. Isn't that, it's, I took that on my phone. Nice pick, Yeah, I'll man. pop that up. Thanks. Sweet photo. But um, yeah, I think we would never find out. No. We got Luke here. He said, hello, my fellow cooked yeast in a straw basket. I like Oh, I it. guess bread in a straw. Okay, I kind of read that wrong. Yeah, that makes sense. We're yeah, he just, wasn't dissing. You, you we're know. all just cooked yeast, and we're in a straw basket. That's yeah. what we all are. I get that. Um, quick question. How many pink cars have you ever seen in your life? Line is 9.5. Over. 
I mean, over, but... It's not like 200, no, but it's, he, it's 50. He brings up a good point. You don't yes, see Yes, I love Russell Westbrook. Love that. Oh, I, I love Russ, too. I love him I lo- for now. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, we'll see how he does. I do love him right now. It's it's a very short leash. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> yeah, if, yeah, yeah, if, yeah. If, if, if we're He's doing just, the thing, though, where he looks good. If we're 0-3 and, and he's, like, shooting and missing, yeah, and then yeah, right away, yeah. I'm like, get him out. But right now, I'm all in on Russ. I am, too. Uh, pink cars, honestly, I think I've seen, like, I, I have seen, like, 320. Oh, you think? I I just I don't think like I think you see a pink car. I'm not I'm not like holy shit, you know. But I you see it and you're just like oh what I I don't even you see it yeah you don't even realize it but you're the seeing li- them. The line should be higher, but um yeah we yeah. We're, we're definitely over. and let's get more pink cars in the market. It's a good it's, it's, it's a good a, color. It's a cool color. This one comes from Justin Herman. I think it's a, a TV show idea, and I honestly, based on what I've read, I think I like it. He said uh, he was listening to the old TV draft. Yeah, and he had this. an idea. Um. It would be like sixty days, and type of st- and the type of style. But hold on, it would be like sixty days and type of style. But they drop professional athletes and and only film them in the courtyard playing basketball. Any sports? I don't know. I, the the yeah, wording I, is kind of it's it's confusing me a little bit. But I think I know what he's talking about. Whoever figure out who the professional athlete is, is released out of prison no oh, matter what crime that. is. So it's like blind singer, but they're playing basketball? Yeah, I'm... And you have what? to guess who it is? That, if that's what it is, that's cool. I didn't know what he meant. I read that. I couldn't I couldn't figure it out. So so I I, I like the idea. I think we got to we gotta go back into the, the lab and kind of figure some, some things out, work some kinks out. If we're just releasing a guy, I mean, the last sentence here is is definitely problematic. He, the, so whoever figures out who the professional athlete is is released out of prison, no matter what the crime is. Oh, see, that's, see, that's we can't, no, see, there's that's, definitely a couple crimes. Well, we can't. Well, yeah, like you know a murderer can't get out. But if there's like a guy that was like tax, I don't know, tax like, fraud, yeah, then like yeah. okay, that's fine. He can Maybe get we, out. If we get just all people that did like crimes that are like not like violent. or like how like uh, marijuana was like a jailable offense, let those guys out. Yeah, well, let's just let them out regardless. But yeah, you definitely. Know what I'm saying yes. Uh, uh, there's something there. There's something there, Justin. I agree. Uh, we got Ebadi writing in. Ebadi. He said, "Good evening, my esteemed gentleman. Esteemed gentleman has really become a, a popular greeting. And it feels good, man. It, it does. Feels I love damn it. Good every single time." He said, "I would like to hear your thoughts on the graham cracker and Oreo beef." I didn't know. I didn't hear about this. I didn't hear about it either. Apparently, or, I'm learning about it right now. Apparently, Oreo made the statement that he was the better s'more, and what? graham cracker was not having it. Oh, what the hell, Oreo? In my opinion, I think Oreo should back off as he already has the title as Milk's favorite cookie. You stole the words yeah, right. What the hell are you talking about? And he said, about? love the pod. I thank you. Um That's just that's baffling. Are we misquoting? What no do why you why are you trying to be a, you're not a small, you're milk's favorite cookie, you're one of the best freaking cookies to ever do it. Don't let Graham Cracker have that. What the asshole. hell are you even talking about? <laughs> yeah, what, what the, the hell, hell are you what the hell are you, you saying? What do you want? You're the better s'more, you're not even a s'more. And what that's just f- does that even mean what the I'm the f- better f- is that, dude? That's so disrespectful. That's, 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 pardon our French, but like I think that that's really ridiculous and, and, and <laughs> watch it with the language. Ridiculous. Yeah. 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 Pardon my French, but that's freaking ridiculous. That's freaking, that's freaking ridic. Yeah, that is weird, man. Maybe does he You're mean, not a s'more, what you mean sandwich better? Better sandwich, maybe, better, but, but graham cracker. Let him have the s'more thing. Are we putting an Oreo into a s'more? I just don't even see the comparison. Part of my French, but that's bull junk. Yeah, no, that's bull junk. That's bull junk. That man. is freaking bull junk, man. And I don't give a, I don't give a hoot. That's ridiculous. Yeah, I don't give a rats, man. Yeah. All right, we got Thomas here. He said, "Hey, Zach and Danny. Hey, hey, man. Um, I came upon some troubling news today. I saw this on Twitter already. You probably saw it too on like Insta or something. Apparently, Dr. Pepper." is under investigation for forging his doctorate. Um, I've been a close friend of the doc for years. We know doc pretty well too, but honestly, I can't say with full confidence that he's in the right here. Just wanted y'all to speak on this. Thomas out. Yeah. It's always been a little bit suspicious because like he got it on, it was an online degree and he got it over COVID and he did online at university of Phoenix. I know, but there's, it's just so many different stories of like, Oh, like and it, cha- it changes. And yeah. that's what's, it's always like, Cause he he's out doing a bunch of stuff. He tells us a story. He tells us different stories every time we see him. When he's and on his book tour, it's a different. It's a it's a tearjerker. Right, 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 right. But then but when, when he tells us, us, he's like, it was oh, no. easy. I just did it yeah, online. I just did it on online. It was COVID. I was bored. So I was yeah. Like, oh. So I was like, which one is it, Doctor Pepper? I'm not like coming at him because I am a fan and and we is a, he's a friend of ours and he's a good dude. It's he's good soda. And it seems like Thomas is in the same boat. It's like he knows we him. And we we like the guy. He's it's got just, a good heart. 
He's got a good heart and he's got a great taste. And so I don't want to talk about his taste. Right no, now, well, but he's got a good, he's got a good lid on his can. He's got a good lid on his can. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I don't know if it's legitimate either. I, who I knows? Know I mean, I will just, we'll just have to see. We'll see this one proceed. Um, yeah, that'll, that'll do it though. What was it? Epi 71. Love y'all. Love you guys.